They don't know how it started, but this fire destroyed eight acres of wheat on this farm near Basildon. Wheat which could have made 40,000 loaves of bread. Everything is tinder dry, so it doesn't take much. A bridle path runs around the field. The cause of the fire could be accidental or it could be deliberate. Ian Frood is the farmer surveying the damage. It's bad, but it could have been a lot worse. Could have, indeed. The wind was blowing that direction, so it more or less burnt itself out against the road. If the wind had been blowing that way, it would have gone through that hedge and then burnt out another 100 acres of cereals that side. I'd the, say the wind's going that way. The so. wind's going that way today, so we don't want to fire today. So the rest of the crops, as far as you're concerned, you want them harvested? ASAP. We want to get them off as soon as possible. It's like the long hot summer of 1976, but some farmers say it's not quite as bad, because in the 12 month run up to this one, it's been very wet. But prices will be going up, because prices for livestock feed are going to go shooting up. You know that saying about making hay while the sun shines? Well, the hay for these cattle is over in the next field. It was being saved for next winter. Not anymore, because the quality of grass in this field is so poor, they're going to have to move the cattle over there next week.